Being this man was tasked to be a mentor for teens, but police say that he abused some of them instead. And a tri-state mother is learning that Dylan Richardson may have sexually abused her daughter. He's been fired from his job at the Dayton, Kentucky YMCA. Nine on your side's TJ Parker is live now in Dayton with that mother's reaction. TJ? Carolyn Tanya, that mother says she's relieved that there will finally be some justice for her daughter. Richardson was a part time employee here at this YMCA teen center in Dayton, Kentucky. Y officials say he had inappropriate relations with several teenage girls. It bugs me. Never thought he'd ever be like that because he's supposed to be a Christian. This mother, who we decided not to identify to protect her daughter's identity, claims her daughter was one of several young victims of this man, Dylan Richardson. I have been hardly been able to sleep or anything. It breaks my heart. Police say Richardson was a part-time coordinator at this YMCA teen center. They tell us a woman came forward saying she and possibly two other girls were sexually abused by Richardson four years ago. In the police report, one of those girls is the daughter of the mother we spoke to. The report says she was abused in a YMCA bathroom when she was just 14. After four years, yeah, it's all coming together. It's not right, no. And I would hate to see anybody else get hurt like this. Barbara Norman's grandkids have been hanging out at the teen center for years. She got a letter from the Y letting her know about Richardson's arrest. Oh my God, I didn't know what to do, and neither did my daughter. So she said the kids cannot go there no more. The YMCA confirms tonight on your side they did fire Richardson. They sent us a statement in part saying he was immediately suspended from all duties at the YMCA. Furthermore, all YMCA employees who have access to children undergo thorough background checks. I don't like it. And really, I don't think he should be out of jail either. Richardson bonded out of jail earlier this week. He has a preliminary hearing scheduled for next week. We're live in Dayton, Kentucky. I'm TJ Parker, 9 on your side.